The timing was kind of perfect too, because we saw that there was an opportunity to bring ethos of Web3 into the creator economy. We saw an opportunity for community members to share the success of the, of the creators that they follow. From that point on, it constantly evolved into all kinds of culture verticals, which is what YA is positioned right now. One of the bigger emphasis for us here is to really break away from conventional Web3 dApps and Web3 application branding and try to make it more lifestyle as possible from tone, from look, from feel, even from the culture verticals we're tapping into right now. We're trying to go in a, in a direction where we know the benefits of Web3 will be felt uh, because it's something that they haven't experienced yet, but, but not necessarily being advocates for the space just as users and just, you know, benefiting from it.